all right my dear so today we're going to discuss about volumetric efficiency of a uh, reciprocating compressor well as you know this is one of the most uh, important topic if you are preparing a complete examination well let's get started what is it basically it is generated by eta v that's why it is known as volumetric efficiency okay now what we have eta v is equal to total uh, or i must say actual volume actual volume by theoretical swept volume actual volume by theoretical swept volume now what is actual volume it is denoted by v theoretical swept volume pi by 4 into d square into l into n upon 60 into k i will let you know what are these terms now i can also write mass flow rate specific volume upon pi by 4 into d square into l into n upon 60 into k if if number of cylinders number of cylinders is not given then take k is equal to 1 if it is given then what will happen you have to take how much cylinders has given in the question so what we got mass flow rate this is a specific volume we know pi d bore diameter length of the stroke and this is rpm and revolution per minute of that cylinder so this is one of the way or one of the uh, formula to find out volumetric efficiency of a reciprocating compressor now let's move to the another method the uh, denotion is same so that is 1 plus c minus c p h upon p l 1 upon n i will let you know what is p h i will let you know also what is p l c is compression c is uh, sorry not compression it's clearance ratio it's clearance ratio so clearance ratio is denoted by c and the if i will define what is clearance ratio that means it is the ratio of clearance volume clearance volume to the swept volume what is soft swept volume the total distance moved by the cylinder and that volume is known as swept volume clearance volume that volume is on the uh, um, the volume uh, which is after the or i can say the volume which contained in the top dead center that is known as uh, vs volume uh, swept volume okay vc clearance volume so so what is vs vs means swept volume and vc is clearance volume okay now suppose that suppose that uh, we have a cylinder okay and this is t dc this is bdc so this volume is known as bc and this volume is known as vs hope you understand okay now this is known as clearance ratio now what is ph or what is pl basically for understanding this thing and is polytropic index hope you know about this okay now what is ph and what is pl this is important to understand so let's go to the ts diagram of bcrs cycle suppose that this is the ts diagram one two three four and the referee is moving like this okay now this is a condenser and this is here we we got evaporator so obviously evaporator temp uh, evaporator pressure is lower pressure condenser pressure is higher pressure so this is all about higher pressure and lower pressure okay so volumetric efficiency of the reciprocating compressor to find out this we need to use p higher and p lower 
okay and uh, i hope you understand how you can calculate volumetric efficiency so we are having two ways to find out volumetric efficiency one is this one another one is this one okay i hope you understand the topic and thanks for watching hope to see you again in my next video bye bye